again, it's just me. I'm going to try another experiment. Uh, I think Tasha made this on her video and it looks so good. I have to try it. Uh, I froze some banana. I got I cut up bananas. I it's gonna be like a banana ice cream. I don't know how well it's gonna come. Uh, other blender is a little bit better than mine, but uh, it has more features. But this one here is powerful enough for it. It's just a matter of blending it properly. So I'm gonna try and make this banana ice cream. It's the first time I'm doing it. So I'm kind of experimenting to see how it comes. It's gonna be sweet no matter what. Uh, I cut up the bananas in small slices. Uh, put them in all in a baggie, put them in the freezer, took them out this morning, put them on the bottom of the refrigerator, and they're still a little bit on the frozen side, but they're definitely cold, so it'll work. Um, I'm going to put them in the blender now and see how it comes, but I'm going to record this video so you can see how it's done, okay? It's pretty simple, you know, just bananas in the blender, that's it. You can add different things to it, you can add dates to it. Um, I was going to add blueberries, but uh, Alice, my wife Alice, is kind of allergic to them a little bit, so I didn't do that, but I could always add them and just blend it in myself. Uh, but I'm going to give it a shot, and I'm going to record it now so you can see it, okay? <coughs> okay, um, I've already put the bananas in the blender because I didn't want to um, put, in, put them in while I was recording this since I have to hold this by hand because then I'm going to get bananas all over the camera, and <laughs> I'm not going to let that happen. But uh, the blender's already set. I want to show you the bananas are already in there, all sliced up. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and put the cover on. I kill this is a Ninja blender, in case anybody's interested in purchasing one. Uh, blend Tech, I know, is also an excellent one. That's what Tasha has. And um, so you just put it in there, you put it on top, you snap the handle down, so it locks into place, and I'm going to go ahead and give this a shot and see how it goes. I'm going to blend it at different speeds because um, sometimes it'll get a little more texture to it that way. Okay, um, it looks like it's pretty smooth. Um, I'm just going to try one more speed. Okay, now I'm just going to lift off the cover. And like I said, this, uh, you know, it um, locks into place, so you don't have to worry about anything happening. I'm just going to put this on the side. And as you can see, it's really blended well. Oh, that looks so good. Um, I'm just going to get a spoon and scrape a little bit off so I can taste it. See how it, see how it came. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and give it a shot. There it is. Came pretty good, it looks like. I'm going to taste it. You won't be able to see me tasting it because, like I said, I'm doing this with one hand. Mmm. Oh, delish. Oh, this is awesome. Okay, it's really, really good. <laughs> um, like I said, I'm blending it just a banana this time, and I didn't have a lot of bananas. Um, this is about four of them, three or four of them cut up into pieces. The next time I'm going to make a bigger batch, so I'm going to have to buy probably about a dozen bananas, but um, it really came good, it's delicious, it's nice and sweet, and there's lots of potassium in it, so if you need potassium, there you go, and it has lots of other vitamins in it also. Um, next time I think I'm going to try it with possibly uh, the bananas, maybe some blueberries, or maybe I'll throw some dates in there also, I just have to get more dates, 
Um, there's a lot of different things you can actually put in there. I can actually mix in some of my date dip, which I made in my last video, and I can uh, go ahead and do that um, and add some in there and just mix it in by hand, um, which I might do that. But this is so sweet. I'm going to enjoy this. Well, all I can say is that it's really good. It's nice and cold. It's almost frozen. And um, it came great. Um, it's so sweet. I'm really going to enjoy this. All I can say is thanks for the hint, Tasha and Seth. Um, just wanted to take this video, and uh, you take care. Bye.